Hi, how are you all hey, doing today? What is Shadow and Act? That's such a it, cool title. Yes, yes. It is a black focused entertainment publication, but we cover all, you know, um, folk films and projects from women, films and projects from all people of color. So we really try to highlight um, the underrepresented in Hollywood. So yeah. Okay. It's, a, it's a great title. Yeah. Yes, thank you, thank Shadow you. So I'm so excited to chat with you both about this series. I am a newcomer to it all, so I'm like, looking at the books as I'm going through the series, but I'm always a sucker for anything that's like has expansive world <laughs> building. So I was like, I'm in, <laughs> I don't care. I'm just, I'm in for it already. So um, Rosamond, I'll start with you first. Of course, Wheel of Time has been just saying for a long time. Um, I remember the announcement first came out, then filming happened, then COVID happened, and then now we are almost about a month out from the series. So how does it feel to finally have this series, season one of Wheel of Time coming out right now? And what are you excited about the most to see as this series comes to life for everyone? I mean, you make this thing in, in a vacuum in a way, but we're also, we've also made it alongside the kind of appetite that we've sensed from fans of the books, which has mm -hmm. been tremendously kind of galvanizing as we've gone along. They've been, we felt their support, you know, they're willing this show well, and that, that means a lot. Um, but now it's, it's, you know, we're aware, I think, that until you're actually on air, um, there's a lot that you don't, st you still don't know. You know, and, and there's a lot to learn from the fan reception. And we're already shooting season two. Um, and I suppose, you know, without being sort of stretched and stricken by the COVID scenario, we yeah. might have learned more about fans reception of season one before beginning season two, but that wasn't to be. Um, so, you know, I'm, I'm excited. We're nervous. You know, we're nervous. It's not, I don't feel it's a done deal that this will be embraced. You know, I don't think you can be sure of anything in this climate the way audiences are taking on material, how discerning yeah. people are, how much, how the expectations have skyrocketed as TV is, you know, uh, there it's is so sorry, much great content. So much TV. Yeah, there's so, so much TV. content and there's so much great content. So, you know, I've got everything crossed because I know what's um, unique about this show. I know that there is definitely, there are definitely elements as you talk about the world building. I mean, Robert Jordan's world building is like, unbelievably good and it's only getting better as the seasons go on and as the books go on but um you know and i know there are elements that are totally unique like you know this 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 one power that only women can wield and um this relationship that we have mm -hmm. the Aya Sedai and warder relationship which is a very complex new way of looking at masculine and feminine energies on screen i think yeah it's i was just i was stuck thinking about how it feels like we've hit the fast forward button you know, when you talk about the show coming out, and it feels like we were in that vacuum for a year and a half, then or two years, and then COVID, but and now it just feels like everything is moving so quickly. And yeah. so it's very surreal, to be honest, that it's actually going to be out in the world. So uh, we're all sort of preparing ourselves as it comes, but uh, we're very excited. Yeah, yeah, I will say I can tell, even though I'm new to all this material, I know that the fans are, you know, very excited, and you know they are excited to see all the, these this, these worlds come like these characters. You know, they're already like planning out like what this series is going to look up look like before it's even out. So yeah. um, I think that there's definitely a lot to anticipate with this. But um, I thank you both so much for chatting with me today, and um, I can't wait for everyone to see this series. And congrats in advance on the launch. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one.